<laughs> it's your girl Shy Gemini and I am back. Yes, I am back with a new video. Um, the reason why I haven't recorded is because I've been on vacation with my mini me. <laughs> it was spring break, so we decided to take a trip to Washington, D.C. Yes, Washington. DC. <laughs> that has never been my ideal vacation spot, but I'll say I'm glad that we went. And the reason why I say that is because I actually had a great time. And although I am not a history buff, I really am not a museum type of person, but I liked it. I enjoyed myself. A lot of history um, was learned. Um, we did a lot of walking, so I'm hoping I've shed a few pounds. <laughs> hoping, pray. I haven't stepped on the scale yet. But I actually had a great time. Saw a lot of different things. We went to the um, Washington uh, Monument, the uh, Lincoln Memorial, MLK Memorial. Um, we also did the Portrait Museum. Um, we saw the Capitol. We saw a lot of stuff. Um, I'm trying to think of everything that we saw. We went to the Native American Museum. Um, we went to, I think it's called the American Museum. It, featured some of the dresses of the first, the former first ladies, um, and the current one. Um, the china, the different china that they used. Um, they had Bozo the clown, the clown suit, the hair, everything. Sesame Street, Mr. Rogers, Bill Nye, the science guy. And it was quite interesting actually to see all those things in person. Oh, phone's about to die. So, yeah, I recommend it. Um, we went to the African American Museum, which I love. We saw, we didn't even get a chance to see everything. That's the, that's the thing. Like, we had a um, 1.30 ticket to get in, because you have to get a ticket. You know that free, you have to get passes, because this is such, High demand, you have to get passes in advance. We got our passes last year, so talk about how far in advance we had to go. Um, they said they don't have tickets until after April, so if you want to go, you have to check and plan like in advance to get your tickets for the African American Museum because so many people want to go there. But I understand why now that I've been there. Wow amazing museum um there are several different floors we didn't get a chance to cover a good chunk of it that's how much is in there um we went on the music section where they had the different costumes of different stars like michael jackson prince ray charles little richard earth wind and fire uh bootsy collins they had Chuck Berry's El Dorado, the entire car upstairs on the, on the top floor. So it's a lot to take in. I would recommend two days because you can't get everything done in one day. We got there at 1.30. We, we had to leave by 4.30 because we were doing those shuttles that take you around to different spots. And the last shuttle was at five, so we couldn't we couldn't stay there. We couldn't cover everything, and I hate that we didn't get a chance to go back. So technically, I'm gonna have to go back because I want to finish the museum. It's a lot. All of the museums are like that, where it could take you hours to go through. I saw the Michelle Obama portrait. I'm just like, wow. I'm just in awe. 
had, I'm like, wow, I really had a good time in D.C. of all places. <laughs> no offense to anybody that lives in D.C. Um, I don't want to talk about your hometown. It's like, I, I hate when people talk about my hometown, Chicago, because everybody always has so much stuff to say about where we live, and they've never even been here before. But, <laughs> yeah, I would recommend going, honestly. Even if you're not a history person or a museum person, go. It's a great experience. I saw the Bill of Rights, the Constitution, the Declaration of Independence, just to stand at the Lincoln Memorial and see like the things that I've seen on TV. I stood where Martin Luther King gave his I Have a Dream speech. Like that that's something. And I hope my daughter took away the same thing that I took away from the trip. So Definitely recommend going there. And you know what? I want to say something to the city of Chicago, okay? Why is it that all of the museums that we went to are free? And they have way more history than what we offer here, okay? Some Museum of Science and Industry, boring. The Planetarium, boring. And they charge us damn near thirty dollars to get in. With all those museums out in Washington, with all the real history, to me, are free. So Chicago, get your shit together, okay? I don't want to have to pay. After seeing that and experiencing that, honestly, like I don't want to go to another Chicago museum ever again because it's laughable, like really. So I'm gonna need them to fix that and not have free days just. So certain times of the year and then when you have free days you got everybody and their goddamn mama trying to go to the museum at the one time at the same time so we all crammed and irritated because everybody trying to take advantage of the free shit because it's so goddamn expensive so y'all need to work on that okay Ugh. that just irritates me thinking about it honestly because <laughs> it makes no sense if you've never been to chicago if you go to a museum here, get ready to spend, honey. Now, the shops in Washington, uh, the gift shops, they were expensive. But you know what? I'll take that versus not only having to spend an arm and a leg to get in the museum, but also got to spend a whole bunch of money for souvenirs and all that stuff, too. Either or. I don't want both. So, y'all need to figure that out. Um... I don't know if I'll ever step foot in the Chicago Museum ever again <laughs> after going to Washington. Like, no. So, yeah, again, I think I'm rambling now. All right. Go to Washington. Take your kids. Have a good time. Plan it. Oh, that's another thing about this trip. Go with people that plan, okay? We had a plan from beginning to end. I honestly had, I, I just showed up. Thank God I went with some people that know how to plan and had an itinerary. So shout out to them um, because we were busy the entire time. No no breaks. I didn't get no rest there. In a good way though, because we were doing stuff. We were actually seeing things. I felt like it was money well spent and I got my money's worth. My daughter had a good time, so. I just truly, honestly hope she took away from it what I took away from it, which was learning a lot of history and the different things um, and how they came into place. So, again, okay, I'm rambling. Um, <laughs> go to Washington, y'all, and uh, learn some things. I, I think you'll have a great time. Alrighty, talk to you later. <laughs>